and welcome back. We're here again tonight to unbox another Farm to People. This is a subscription box that is local artisan products um, to support small businesses. It's really interesting. I have really enjoyed this box. Um, I did find a Groupon for it. So I can't really tell you what the subscription price is. I don't really remember. Except I, but if you look on Groupon, it's been on there several times. So first we get our card with the um, products on it. This is a Snacktastic take, tasting box. Now they do have a couple different subscriptions that you can get. I um, got the full tasting box. So let's see what we have in there this month. And they do package everything really, really well. Taos Mountain Energy Bar, toasted coconut, gluten-free, non-GMO, artisan crafted. This is a blend of crunchy almonds, flaky toasted coconut, honey, vanilla, and a sprinkling of sea salt. This bar is bold, ambitious, and full of nutrition and delicious. So that's our Taos Energy Bar. It sounds really quite good. I was just looking to see. The serving size is one bar, and I'm not going to go into all that. It um, is organic and non-GMO. However, it is processed in a facility that does use peanuts. Next, we have pepitas, brined and roasted heirloom pumpkin seeds. These are from the Finger Lakes, New York, grown and made there. Stony Brook Wholehearted Foods. These are um, pumpkin seeds. It says they're loaded with nutrients, vitamin E, zinc, copper, manganese, and some other stuff. Not a real big fan of pumpkin seeds. I do like them on salad, but we'll see what these are like. Yeah, they look like there's a shells and everything, so I'm not too sure about this. Next, we have Q nuts, bananas, foster pecans. No gluten, no sodium. These are vegan. Inspired by classic New Orleans dessert, Q nuts, banana fosters, pecans smothered in rum, vanilla, cane sugar, and real banana. That sounds really yummy. That's a four ounce size. One nice thing about these, the products are all a really nice size. Okay, then we have some Smoky and savory hickory beef and porch sticks made by Righteous the Righteous Felon. There's, we get two of those. And again, they're a nice one ounce size. Uh, comprised of 60% beef, 40% pork with hints of garlic, onion, pepper and sea salt. So those are always nice to have as a quick snack if you're on the go somewhere. And lastly, and I love how they package stuff. This is like a crinkly paper stuff. It's much nicer than the bubble wrap, more green friendly. And it, it always package things really good so that you don't get anything broken these are dill death dill death do us part pickles i love dill pickles so i'm sure i'm gonna like these i like dill pickles better than sweet pickles if i can ever get these out of the wrapping okay now this is a full size 16 ounce jar backyard brine handmade artisan pickles 
North Fork, New York. As you can probably guess, most of this stuff does come from New York. Look at that. And there's pieces of garlic in there. I think these are going to be really, really good. This plate company is based on Long Island, um, using fresh local ingredients, some from their own garden. They provide the, these pickles provide the perfect crunch to your sandwich or burger, and the classic dill taste makes them irresistible. I am excited to try these because, like I said, I love dill pickles. So that's our box this month. We got the nut, the pecans, the pumpkin seeds, the beef sticks, the energy bar, and best of all, the pickles. So I hope you like what you saw. Be sure to hit the like and subscribe button. And one more thing I wanted to say we usually don't remember is we do purchase all these boxes that we unbox. We don't have any sponsors. So be sure to hit that like and subscribe button. Thank you.